everybody. This is Brian from PMB Homesteading. Thought I'd do a little shot of the backyard and the projects we did for Easter weekend. So Saturday, I went and picked up a couple of yards. Well, I got eight yards of hog fuel, which is basically a hardwood mulch that is cut in bigger cuts. So it's not the bark like you see, like with bark dust mulch. This is more the uh, actual hardwood, like they take the stumps and the limbs of hardwood trees and they grind them up into a material that looks like that. And so I basically got eight yards of that and spread that around by myself because Paula was busy inside doing things to get ready for our Easter dinner. But uh, that's kind of one of the things that I did this weekend out here. You can see in the garden boxes, cover crops coming up nicely. So everything's coming up as it expects to do early spring. I'm happy with the, uh, the germination rate on that cover crop, so it should be a pretty good mass of uh, chop and drop by the time I'm ready to plant these beds. I'll be covering those up with the greenhouse plastic, as I mentioned last weekend. So let's go up here and I can kind of give you some shots of you know where I spread the mulch. So we put the mulch, mulch pretty much everywhere out in between all the garden boxes and on the trail system that we have that the dogs like to run on. shot from the upper deck. So you can see all throughout there, all new mulch down along the trails. And then up through that area and up behind. And so next weekend we're probably going to go get some about uh, three more yards of mulch and I'll put it in between all the garden box trails as well as up on the hillside way up there because it needs to be redone. We haven't done that in about five years. So it takes quite a while for that stuff to break down. So it's really, really hardy to last a long time instead of like regular, we used to do bark dust and that usually breaks down after a year or two and it's way more expensive because we're getting this hog fuel for around $15 a yard. So for you know less than a hundred bucks, we're getting pretty much all of our, our bark mulch done. And when it breaks down, it does have a nice uh, effect to create a mycelium bed where the internet web of the soil can grow underneath and give us lots of fertility. Here's some of our little birds we feed. But that's kind of the update for this weekend, Easter weekend, 2018. All right. Well, it's been Brian from PMB Homesteading. Talk to you guys again. Bye.